Bonjour YouTube, welcome back to another Manchester United women's review test game. Under 21 squad up against Hull City ladies. First time these two teams ever faced each other, quite obviously, with Hull City not being in the squad or in the uh, championship last year. They are an F, and I can't remember what it's called. It's like yeah, I can't remember what it's called. I think it's called National League or something like that. The third tier. But going to the lineup from Man United's under 21 squad. It's under, yeah, I believe it is under 21s. Uh, wearing red, white, white in this jersey. Manchester United player Maria Edwards, who I believe played also in the friendly against Sanjiford. Brilliant prospect for the future. That player, she's going to be incredible. Just going to line up Alex Everett. Unfortunately, there's no actual formation. Someone's going to name the players because I don't know what position they'll play. But anyway, Alex Everett in goal, probably in goal, given the number one. Chloe Bruna, Isabel Rideford, Lara Miller, Poppy Larson. I guess that makes up the defence. Chloe Howard, Amelia Wilson, Rebecca May, Mariah Edwards make up the midfield. Chloe Williams and Megan Hornby. Complete the lineup with one sub, Neve Murphy. Only the one substitute, but anyway. Uh, and then I'm not going to go through the whole series lineup because that doesn't really matter. <laughs> so, going into the goals, it took until the half hour mark for the first goal to be scored, and unfortunately, it was scored by Hall City. Going 1 0 up through Amelia Smith, but then Eight minutes later, this player, who I've already mentioned, going to be a brilliant prospect for Man United. Hopefully she gets some good game time in the cup competitions. Maria Edwards, 38th minute, scoring a goal to bring United level with Hull City. And just four minutes later, gets a brace. Brilliant display from her to pick up two very quick goals for Manchester United and to get off the mark in this pre-season friendly. Uh, it's very good to see. She's going to be an incredible player. Uh, I feel like if she does play next season, it will be in the cup competitions against the championship sides, who we obviously faced last season. Uh, if we do come up against them, that is. Because I can't remember what the group is like for the uh, Continental. All I know is that we have Man City again, which is going to be, if we do beat them in the league, it will be incredible. I don't know when those fixtures are, for the continental group stage, usually they're end of August, so what well, was that the wait and see? But half time, it was two goals to one for Manchester United. Murray Edwards picking up both goals with Emily Smith scoring the only goal for Hull City. And then going to the second half, very quickly off the mark, Amelia Wilson scoring for Manchester United. 47th minute, 3 1 up. Pretty good display from United. Obviously, that's a good thing to see. Getting goals for these youth players who try to impress and go into the first team. I was with the new acquisitions this season, but we're still kind of light. I think it was four out, five in, if I can remember correctly, something like that. So we do need more players, and Maria Edwards proved today why she should come in, could be a striker, to challenge Jess Sigilbert, Jane Ross, just to add more competition. Sort of like what Mason Greenwood will be doing to Rashford and Anthony Martial. <clears throat> but then, 55th minute, Maria Edwards completing her hat-trick. Scoring three goals, obviously that's what hat-trick is. And then, brilliant display. I think, as I said, she will burst into the scene. That's a hat-trick, if you consider it. Like, first goal, 38th minute. Second goal, 42nd minute. And third goal, 55th minute. Less than 20 minutes to score that hat-trick is incredible but then one minute later whole city score a consolation goal at the time they it would have known as a consolation goal but emily smith scoring to make it four goals to two that's how it stayed for the whole game manchester united women coming away with this win against the national league side well done to united good run out for the players on the 21 side four goals to two 
And that's pretty much that. Leave a like, subscribe for more Manchester United women's reviews. I'm not too sure if there's any more pre-season matches. There might be. And if there is, I will be reviewing them. So be sure to click subscribe. And bye.